Right. Hello everyone. Um, I take off my ma mask, face mask. I just wanted to show you, I mean this is the object of our time. This is my mask. Stay free, remain free. It's, uh, it's written on it. So, um, thank you for inviting me and it's, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's a very special situation because uh, normally um, a conference is partly a pretext just for coming together and having uh, real-time encounters, small talk, cafes, cigarettes, uh, everything and uh, this uh, this is equally important part of uh, of a conference now in in a new situation we we, we had to deconstruct this situation like uh, many other situations of our everyday and professional life so deconstruction has a has a new uh, new uh, uh, hmm new meaning uh, in, in our time. My name is Janusz Sugar. I'm an artist and uh, I'm teaching at the Art University. I'm, I'm mentioning this because uh, it's, uh, it's important to uh, define the very beginning if, that uh, if, if I'm talking, I'm, I'm talking from this position because I have this experience at the university uh, experience. With other terms, uh, I'm representing, not alone here in this circle, the so-called academic art, artist education. It's a mm, rather bureaucratic term. Uh, it's, a, it's a completely bureaucratic language. I, uh, I don't really like it because I think uh, this uh, uh, bureaucracy um, invaded our everyday language, but anyway, uh, this is it. And uh, um, yeah. if I need to give a, a, a title to this talk, to my contribution, uh, here is my title. As, as you see, it's a slightly uh, changed version of the general title of the, of, the, of the conference. Reforming the formed. Reforming which, uh, which, uh, which was already formed. And uh, uh, in, in this context, what was formed is the, this uh, academic situation. And, and we have to find ways how to reform it in, a, in, a, in an era, in a time where both terms, academy, university, and, uh, and art, art education, um, are very problematic and, uh, and uh, they are questioned in, in, in many different ways. In, in, in uh, everywhere. Uh, the academy is, is questioned in general like uh, science, professional science is, is questioned in many ways. We, we live in a so-called post-truth, post-factual uh, era. And, uh, and in, uh, in, in, in such a setup, the academic freedom, the autonomy of universities are not really welcomed or at least uh, questioned uh, everywhere. And uh, we face the same problem somehow concerning art. Because uh, our modernistic, uh, modernistic uh, art notion based on something which is uh, which which might be invisible for uh, for uh, for for many this is the growth the growth 
which is the the uh, basement of uh, basic the foundation of the market uh, capitalism. If there is no growth, th there is a crisis, and this notion of growth uh, uh, invaded uh, uh, our our life in 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 many sense. Our, um, uh, our relationship with each other and uh, in, in many areas. And this growth is the, is the support of those institutions we, we like to keep and we rely on museums, galleries and, and, and um, art market, um, publications, everywhere, uh, everything concerning uh, art. And of course, not just art. And uh, we are in a uh, we are in a in an era where uh, multiple crises uh, are around us. I don't have to count them, but everyone knows: financial crisis, uh, political crisis, ecological crisis. And uh, if we would like to um, uh, survive as uh, humanity. And if we would like to keep at least some of our um, um, uh, best achievements, we, we have to change many things. We have to change our way of thinking, especially uh, we have to change our thinking or our idea about growth. And uh, it could change our uh, notion of art. Um, um, and, and uh, uh, we, we can see uh, some signs of it in, uh, in this pandemic situation because uh, 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 the businesses are not working, uh, there is no public, uh, there are no exhibitions and uh, we are desperately seeking new forms um, of, uh, of, uh, of uh, encounter with the, with the public. But it's not so easy because uh, art uh, is uh, primarily based on uh, on real-time um, um, uh, encounters, real-time uh, relationships. We can learn lots of uh, inf uh, lots of things in in books and slideshows and reproductions, but the the the, the real. Uh, 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 perception of an artwork, either a, whatever, a, a, either a theater piece or a visual art piece or um, etc. Uh, we, we have to be present. We have to be there, and uh, and we have uh, to have uh, institutions uh, for such uh, such um, encounters. At the beginning of, of this short talk, I mentioned my position. Uh, um, uh, going back to this, uh, uh, I, I would like to add a, a further element. Um, I feel myself living and, and working in, in Hungary uh, like uh, being in a laboratory. Uh, what is a laboratory? A laboratory uh, is, uh, is a place where, uh, I mean, in this uh, um, definition, um, uh, where um, some larger scale events can be uh, researched in a small scale situation. So uh, uh, living in, in Hungary, which is one of those uh, existing uh, oxymorons, the so-called illiberal uh, democracies, I feel the problems of those two above mentioned term um, in a very strong way, very uh, everyday way. Um, um, let's speak about the academic situation. Uh, um, there is an um, ongoing process in, in Hungary to privatize all the universities. Um, it, it could be, uh, I mean, in itself it doesn't have any, um, any, any value, I mean, um, uh, lots of universities uh, uh, around the world are, are, are pri privately founded universities, 
but uh, it's it's a rather different concept here in in Hungary. Uh, uh, um, pri uh, uh, privatization of universities doesn't mean uh, give some uh, or en enhance the uh, independence or the autonomy of the university. Just the opposite. Uh, uh, um, there is a, a, a foundation with some members above the, uh, the, the, the usual heads of the universities, the deans and the, the rectors, and uh, they, uh, they have a, a full power. So uh, prob uh, practically they are the real leaders, the uh, uh, universities. Um, um, in, in Hungary, uh, if my information are right, there are six universities which are not yet uh, uh, privatized, and those are mainly the so-called art universities, uh, uh, dance, uh, music, uh, uh, visual art, which is uh, ours, where I'm, I'm, I'm working. And recently, um, mm, um, maybe you've heard about there, there was, a, or there still there is, a huge protest of the students of the theater and, and film uh, University of Budapest, because uh, uh, they, uh, 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 I mean, the the, the government uh, changed the, the university's legal status, privatized in such a way that uh, uh, without any kind of dialogue or uh, negotiations with uh, with uh, uh, professors, students other teachers of, of the university. And that's why the extremely brave uh, students of the Theater and Film Academy, they occupied the university. Uh, you can imagine, it's, it's a rather big thing in, in a country like, uh, like uh, Hungary. They occupied their university, and uh, which is, from this point, when I'm talking about, uh, is even more important, they introduced something which they called Teaching Republic. Teaching Republic. Uh, I, I will go back uh, to this. And by the way, uh, uh, um, I, I will give, uh, give out some uh, um, um, Word documents uh, um, um, containing all the references and, uh, and, uh, and, and links uh, uh, about things I'm, I'm, I'm mentioning. Okay, I, I, I spoke about laboratory and, uh, and uh, academic situation and uh, I, I, I don't think that I have to uh, speak too much about the situation of art in, in Hungary. Uh, it's, it's another issue uh, which, uh, which, which follows the, the similar model. Uh, I don't want to go into the details because it's, uh, it's too complicated and it's not uh, the, the, the topic of, of this talk, but I, I try to give you some, uh, some, uh, some, some links, or you can ask me later, of course. And, uh, and uh, I'm, I'm just mentioning that, uh, um, that uh, culture politics, uh, um, uh, control of art, um, uh, censorship, and the worst thing, uh, self-censorship and the censorship of the uh, the the mm, the, the middlemen um, are, are back in in Hungary. So uh, the the big cultural institutions like uh, museums um, uh, 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 and 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 similar ones, they are really very much controlled and uh, and. Uh, um, mm, they don't really have. They don't really want to show any kind of critical um, um, positions um, or, or, or critical art, or let's say um, um, problematic art, or, or something which people have to uh, un un understand and 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 uh, and, uh, and and think about and um, and uh, and somehow uh, interpret. Uh, just uh, it, uh, the, the the general attitude is just being very very transparent 
and and simple and and, and no politics, no um, uh, no um, uh, critical uh, position. Um, The general question, uh, going back to the academic situation, why do we need um, 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 academic art education? Um, it's, it's not just a rhetorical question, it's, it's a practical question, because uh, if, uh, if, if we look around, uh, we, we find that uh, uh, all the mat materials, all the equipments uh, uh, are available for everyone. So uh, um, there, there is not such a difference between a professional video equipment and the so-called consumer electronics. And, uh, and we all know about uh, very good movies which were made on, on, uh, on a, with, a, with a telephone or a, with a um, um, medium uh, digital camera, etc. And, uh, and uh, plus, uh, people can find all the tutorials, uh, all the necessary information uh, of, of using uh, those equipments uh, on the internet, in bookstore, in libraries, uh, everywhere. And uh, this is the same with, uh, with, uh, uh, with, uh, with other areas. With, uh, we can, people can find all the necessary knowledge if they if they uh, um, need it, and uh, and uh, uh, this raises the question: uh, What can we offer at at, uh, at an art university? If we if we if we see it in a very uh, uh, let's say a dry way, we can say that on one hand we can offer a kind of uh, existential safe heaven. You know, it, uh, the nowadays the position of a student is a very safe position um, uh, from the point of existence. Because uh, in the spirit of uh, a division of labor, a university degree could, uh, could uh, direct a, a kind of uh, career path with, uh, with uh, BA, MA, DLA, uh, etc. And of course, a university could uh, could uh, could offer uh, high-level uh, uh, knowledge and uh, and uh, and uh, professional equipments and uh, uh, together a kind of a, a playground. And uh, maybe the third aspect that a university education could offer uh, generational uh, uh, contacts, relationships cooperations and, uh, and, and some help to the uh, emergen, uh, emergence. And uh, um, this was a question, of course, this is the question for, for, for all of us. And I think, uh, and it's not just an easy position, I think that we, we cannot give a general answer for this. I, I think uh, very seriously that we can think uh, we can give answers ju just particular questions and this is my experience because uh, at the beginning I mentioned that I'm teaching at the art university of of of, of Hungary uh, but uh, uh, my teaching uh, experience uh, I, I never wanted to teach I never had such an ambition I never wanted to go to the uh, a a academy I was completely happy with my art artistic activity but uh, uh, parallel with the political changes which was a, a rather similar situation like now uh, in 89-90 the that time students they, they started the revolt against the that time leadership of the university and uh, and uh, uh, it, it was a longer longer process and uh, at, at the end they invited some some new uh, uh, new people and I was one among us and uh, and uh, I, I, later, or in other situation, I can explain our, 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 our daily practice. But uh, to, to, to cut a very long and long and, com uh, and complicated story short, I would say uh, that we did something 
which, uh, which could be defined by, those, uh, by that term I mentioned earlier, teaching republic. Because uh, one of our f uh, major or most important decisions was that we uh, didn't want to uh, 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 follow that uh, traditional um, uh, the tradition um, 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 called uh, master classes. We don't have master classes. We, we have a, a bunch of uh, um, 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 teachers, very experienced uh, 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 people, and uh, uh, their, their um, um, topics and their um, um, courses, they, they are overlapping. So the student doesn't have to choose uh, um, a, a master. And, uh, and uh, I, I think uh, this, uh, um, I, I would close this short uh, uh, contribution with this, that uh, maybe we have to think about the, the uh, um, possibilities of, uh, of teaching republics uh, um, a, a new kind of uh, um, academic artistic education in the time of crisis, pandemic, and, uh, and, uh, and, and political populism. Uh, because uh, we, we have to defend our, our values. And, uh, and uh, I, I think art uh, could play a very important uh, role in this. Maybe not uh, in, the, in the traditional way, or not just the traditional way, but in different new ways. And uh, to find those new ways, uh, the universities, the u uh, university academic art education could be uh, a larger laboratory. Thank you very much. And as a gesture, I take my mask. <laughs>